Chris had his stroke on the 19th of July 2004. It was our 24th wedding anniversary, so I had the day off of work and we went out for lunch. And at the end of the lunch, as we were having coffee, I just noticed that his cup was spilling the coffee out. And I looked up and I could actually see that the side of his face had gone and that he was having a stroke. Originally, they told me that he was likely to die that day, they didn't think he would survive at all. She loves Chris. He's her husband and she wants to give him the best life and the best care that she can and that's what she does. A hairdresser that um, used to come to me introduced me to um, what is now called the Carer Support Centre and they ran monthly meetings in Thornbury. So I actually started to attend those meetings and now I employ a facilitator and I help run the carer support group myself. I'm also um, a carer representative through the Carer Support Centre and once a quarter I um, attend a carer's advisory partnership meeting with representatives from South Gloss Council and we raise issues that carers have. She helps them to have that voice that maybe they won't project for themselves but she'll help them to do that. She's very approachable. I've actually started um, two former carers groups, one in Kingswood and one in Thornbury because of course when a cared for dies the carer can feel very lost. Looking after Chris, it is a full-time commitment but it is complete, absolutely unconditional love for him.